from the NBC 10 Money Watchers tonight on the dotted line. Providence Mayor Jorge Aloiza approved the city's newest budget with a wave of his pen this afternoon. And Money Watcher Allison Bologna was there for the signing. She talked with the mayor about what this plan means for Providence. Allison? Teresa, I spoke with the city council president as well. This is for the start of fiscal year 2016 on July 1st. The signing process today went off without a hitch. Signed the budget. It's this mayor's first. He says the process was collaborative. That's the approach that I've taken. That's the approach that uh, council president and, his, and the entire city council has taken. The $696 million budget does not raise taxes on residents or businesses in Providence. We asked about the city's business friendliness, which the mayor confirms needs to change. He talked about creating a concierge type service in City Hall to welcome new businesses in to change the business climate. Another goal is to fix this problem. Boarded up homes with absentee landlords. Landlords now will get a 65 cent tax cut per thousand dollars. Is this budget business friendly? I think so. I mean, we, we've done some things that uh, we've frozen the commercial tax rate for the fourth year. Uh, we've lowered the non owner occupant uh, uh, tax rate, and that's important to note because uh, in, in neighborhoods throughout our city, there are vacant and boarded up pieces of property that have been sitting vacant and fallow for years. And when we talk to developers and folks in that industry, um, they're shying away from making investments in Providence because that tax rate is excessive. It is the highest in the state. So they're hoping that will change. Now that the mayor has signed the budget, it is a done deal. Tight and lean is how he continues to describe it. Alison Bologna, NBC 10 News.